Okay, this is my honest review about the autopilot system, Flywing H2, which is connected right there. Has two GPSs, one there, one over there. And there's the software. When you first open it up, it's everything is in Chinese. It doesn't save the settings so it can stay in the English. You gotta come all the way down and hit this here and go to English. This is, this program seems worse than the H1. I'm gonna tell you that now. In my opinion, she's not worth it. Uh, let's go to the radio. I'm gonna kick connect. I'm gonna connect that right there. It's loaded. There she goes. All right, she loaded. Now I'm gonna move the flight controller. You'll see it here, see it right there moving, right there. Uh, it won't do anything about your satellites or anything until you uh, connect the receiver. Here's your sensors, so you won't read them unless you put a receiver. There's your parameters, which is way, way more complicated than the, the H1. I'm gonna tell you that now. Let's go to home. See it says, please connect the receiver. Uh, oh, you get an error. See, it's not there. In my opinion, this is not worth the money. Uh, you, you're gonna go through a lot more headaches than you do with the H1, as far as I'm concerned. I wasted the money to see, I wanted to see. I've got the H1, uh, I like the H1. In fact, I've got it on this Hilo, the H1. There it is, on this Hilo. So, for y'all that wanna go out and buy yourself one, I would think twice about spending the money on this if you wanna go through more headaches. Uh, and it's, of course, it's a lot more. That's my opinion, thank you.